watching sports. It's in the game. Hey guys, welcome to NCAA March Madness 2004. Yeah, I know it's been a long time coming and we're here, so let's go ahead and, and uh, dig into it. So, it was to do a select your favorite school, which they don't save on this, which I don't know why, but you probably all know who I'm going to choose. <laughs> so, there. So, anyway, so you got your original. To play now with your with your exhibition game game modes you got to play online season dynasty mascot robbery tournaments and practice and also my plus my NCAA my your bio and plus your favorite school so that's all it is then school management which is we just create a, or, or, or edit a, a school create player edit player and then a Reorder rosters. Then your options, you got rules, purposes, gameplay, in game settings, load and save, as usual, and then, then your uh, eSports X extras, which got cameos, as the, the, the coach, and then the other game, so, and credits. So, anyhow, let's introduce you to, to the teams here. We'll go to the, uh, right from the start. Oh, wait. I forgot one, 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 one more thing in here. In, in, in the game mode. So, anywho. So, in Dynasty, which it took me long to, to complete, but anywho. Here's the uh, teams and, and, and conferences I actually want in, in um, uh, Dynasty, so because I got them all written down here. So in the American East, I I, I want it with uh, uh, with uh, Vermont. Then the Atlantic, the Atlantic Ten, I uh, want it with the uh, uh, Temple. Then the ACC, I actually want it with Duke. Then the Atlantic Sun, I uh, want it with with the Georgia State. Then in the Big Ten, I uh, won it with Michigan State. Then the Big 12, I uh, won it with, with Kansas. Then the Big East, I uh, won it with, with, the, with the Syracuse. And the Big Sky, I, uh, I uh, won it with, uh, with the Portland State. And then in the Big South, I won it with the Birmingham Southern. In the Big West, I uh, won it with uh, Utah State. In the Continental, uh, uh, I mean the uh, the uh, 
Colonial, I uh, won with the North Carolina uh, 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 Wilmington. Then the CUSA, I uh, won with um, uh, Louisville, which I was uh, final rank was 20, and the final record was 23 and 9. Which, which, which the other teams I mentioned, which I don't, I can't remember what their final rank was or the record was. And then in the, oops, lost my spot. Sorry. Okay, in the Horizon League, I uh, won with Butler, and my final rank was 87, and my final record was 19 in, in, a, in a 13. Then the Ivy League, I uh, won with Pennsylvania, with the final rank of 108, and the final record was 919, which I did not win the conference because I didn't make it to the uh, uh, conference to tournament, so yeah, so I didn't win with the, with the Pennsylvania, so yeah, because they were bad. <laughs> They're a bad team to play. Okay, then the uh, Metro, uh, the Metro Atlantic. I uh, won in with uh, Manhattan, and my final rank was 106, and the final record was 17-15. Then in then uh, then then the MAC I was Kent State, and my final rank was 46, and my final record was 20 and 20 and 12. Then the Mid Continent I was a uh, Val. Palacio, and I, and my final rank was 92, and my final record was 23 and 8. Then in the, in, well, then the NEAC, I was uh, North Fork State, and my final re record, uh, which I won the conference, and which my final record was 252, and the, and my final record was 1715. Then, uh, then, the Missouri Valley, I was, uh, uh, Creighton, and my final record was 36, and the final record was 25 and 6. Then the Mount West, I, I was Utah, and which I won it, and my final record was 63, and my final record was 17-14. Then the Northeast, I was a Wagner, and my final record was 153, and my final record was... 10 and 10 and 10 and 10 18, which I, which I, uh, which I never made to the conference because of my my record te technically for, for that one. So I so I went one one with um, Wagner. Then in Ohio Valley, I was Austin Pay, which I won that conference. And and my final record was 123. Well, my final record was 1615. And of course, Pac-10, I was, I was, of course, the Oregon Ducks. Of course, of course. <laughs> and which I won the national championship with them by beating Michigan State 58-84. I, I, I whooped them. And my final rank was number one, and my record was 36-0. So, yeah, I'm beating season that one. Then the Patriot League, I was Holy Cross, and my, which I won that one with them. And my final rank was 88 and my final record was 21 and 10. Then in the SEC, I was Kentucky, in which I won that one with, with them, the conference. Which my, which my final rank was 24, and my final record was 21 and 10. Then the SoCon, I was 10 and Tennessee, Chattanooga, which my which I won with with the, the conference with this team. In which my final rank was 100, and my final record was was 18-14. Then the Southland, I was McNissy, yeah, McNissy State, and I won, and which I won with, with them, with, uh, with conference, and my final rank was 116, and my final record was 22 and 8. And in the Southwestern, I was Alabama State, which I won it with them, the conference, and my final rank was 232, and my final record was 1714. Then the Sun Belt, I was Western Kentucky. And I won it with, with them, the conference, and my final rank was 108, and, and my final record was 1517. Then the whack, I was, of course, Boise State. And I went 29 and, 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 and 4, and my final rank was 66. So so I did go unbeaten with them. But for Gonzaga, yep, the whack. With them, I went 34 and 1. And my final rank was, was, was three. So, yeah. 
So Oregon was the only team I had the unbeaten season with. And as far as the robbery games go here, so anywho, for Bam and Auburn, I was Auburn beating them 73 44. Then, then, then I was Appalachian State beating Davidson 10 4 67. And then I was Arizona beating Arizona State 79 53. And then I was uh, Balls. Wait, no. Yeah, uh, yeah. Um, I was Ball State beating Bowling Green 65 to 57. And I was uh, Brigham Young beating Utah 86 to 49. Then I was Stanford beating California 69 to 50. Then I was Cincinnati beating Xavier 77 to 55. And I was Clemson beating South Carolina 67 to 42. And then I was uh, Wyoming beating Colorado State 70 to 46. And then I was um, Dayton beating the St. Louis 754. And, and I was DP Paul beating uh, Marquette 67 64 by, by three. It was a close game. And, uh, and, and I was North Carolina beating uh, Duke 84 68. And I was East Tennessee State beating the Tennessee Chattanooga 79 53. And I was Fresno State beating uh, UNLV 72 46. And I was Syracuse beating Georgetown 82 58. And I was George, Georgia beating Georgia Tech 74 41. And I was uh, Wolford beating Georgia South 64 57. And I was Gonzaga, of course, beating Portland 74 42. And I was Yale beating Harvard 64 49. And I was Illinois beating Northwestern 79 55. And I was beating, and well, I was Indiana beating Purdue 74 49. And I was Kansas beating Missouri 79 61. And I was Louisville beating Kentucky 68 59. And I was Massachusetts beating Rhode Island 79 77. Only when I went by two. And then I was Michigan State beating Michigan 83 61. And I was Mississippi State beating Ole Miss 62 58. And I was Montana beating Montana State 66 49. And I was NC State uh, beating uh, Wake Forest set, uh, um, uh, 90 to 60. And I was Ohio State beating Ohio 64 44. And the Civil War, of course, I was the Ducks beating, beating the Beavs 89 59. And then I was put Princeton beating, beating the Pennsylvania uh, 86 39. I whooped them that. <laughs> well, then, then, and I was St. Joseph's beating Temple 73 58. And I was St. Clara beating San Francisco, 83-64. And I was VMI beating via, uh, via Kendall, uh, 73-68. And I was USC beating UCLA, 76-58. And I was Virginia Tech beating Virginia, 82-63. And the Apple Cup, I was Washington beating Washington State, 81-49. So yeah, so, yeah, so that's all the uh, Civil War game, I mean the uh, Robber games right there, so. <coughs> that did. Too bad they, they, they can't keep your uh, record on, on, on all of them. So. so here, let's go ahead and, and uh, meet the teams. Okay, here we go, starting off. Anyway, we got Air Force, Akron, number 38th ranked Alabama, Alabama A&M, Alabama uh, Birmingham, Alabama State, Albany, Alcorn State, American, Appalachian State, number 6 ranked Arizona, number 31 ranked Arizona State. Yeah, I know the uh, rankings go to 50. That's how they got them ranked. So they got so they got Arkansas, uh, Arkansas Little Rock, uh, Arkansas uh, Pine Bluff, Arkansas State, Army, number number point six Frank Auburn, Austin Pay, Ball State, Baltimore, Baylor, Belmont, Bethany Cookman, Birmingham Southern, Bowling Springs. Boise State, Boston, Boston College, number 40 ranked, and uh, uh, Bowling Green, 
Bradley, Brigham Young, Brown, Bucknell, Buffalo, Butler, number three, 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 three ranked. Then uh, Cal State Fullerton, then Cal State Northridge, then uh, Cal Pony, I mean, I'm going Cal, uh, Cal Poly, sorry. <laughs> then uh, number 24th ranked California, Campbell, Ken Suis, Kenny Suis, sorry guys, if I can't pronounce that right, sorry about that. Then a Central Connecticut State, Central Florida, number number 37 ranked uh, Central Michigan, then C, uh, Kilman, Chairman, then Chimene, if I can't pronounce that right, sorry. Then a, then a, then Charlie's, then Charlie's, Charleston, then Charleston Southern, Ch Chicago State, Cincinnati, number 13th ranked, uh, Clemson, Cle Cleveland State, Coastal Carolina, Colgate, number 36th ranked Colorado, Colorado State, Columbia, number one ranked Connecticut, Coppin State, State, Cornell, Creighton, number 20, 20th ranked, Dartmouth, Davidson, 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 then then at Dayton, D De, Paul, Delaware, the Delaware State, Denver, Detroit. Drake, Drexel, number two ranked Duke, 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 Duke Wesney, uh, I, which I hope I pronounced that right. Then, uh, uh, then Eastern Washington, East Carolina, East uh, East Tennessee State, Eastern Illinois, Eastern Kentucky, Eastern Michigan, Elon. Evansville, Fairfield, Farley Dick, then number 10 ranked Florida, Florida A&M, Florida Atlantic, Florida International, Florida State, Fordham, Fresno State, Furman, and then a George and Mason, George Washington, Georgetown, Georgia, Georgia Southern, Georgia State, Georgia Tech, number fifth ring Gonzaga, all my teams, Grambling State, Hampton, Hartford, Harvard, Hawaii, High Point, Hofs, 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 Hofstra, sorry about that, dang stuttering, Holy Cross, Houston, Howard, IUPUI, uh, Idaho, Idaho State, number, uh, number 12th ranked Illinois, Illinois State, Illinois Ch Ch Chicago, number 34th ranked Indiana, Indiana State, Iona, Iowa, Iowa State, Jackson State, Jacksonville, Jacksonville State, James J James Madison, number uh, number eighth ranked Kansas, Kansas State, Kent State, number fifteenth ranked Kentucky, and Loyola Marymount, and Louisiana State, and number thirty ninth ranked La uh, La Salle, Lafayette, Lamar, Lehigh, Liberty. Long Beach State, Long Island, Louisiana Tech, Louisiana Lafayette, Louisiana Monroe, number 20th Louisville, Loyola UC, Maine, Man Manhattan, number number uh, number 47th ranked, and then uh, Mar Marnus, Marquette. Marshall, 
number number uh, number twenty fifth ranked uh, Maryland, Maryland, BC, Maryland ES, Massachusetts, Mc McNeese State, number thirty is ranked um, Memphis, Mercer, Miami, Miami Ohio, Michigan, number three ranked Michigan State, Middle Middle Tennessee, Minnesota, Mississippi State. Mississippi uh, uh, Valley State, Missouri, number uh, number fourth ranked, and Miss, uh, Missouri Kansas City, Mon Monmouth, Mon Montana, Montana State, Warhead State, Morgan State, Mount St. Mary's, Murray State, North North, North, uh, North Carolina uh, Ashton. North, uh, North Carolina Charlotte, North, North, uh, North Carolina Greensboro, North Carolina State, and number uh, number twenty one ranked, North, uh, North Carolina uh, Wilmington, New York College, Navy, Nebraska, Nevada, New Hampshire, New Mexico, New Mexico State, New Orleans, Night, Night, uh, Night. Uh, Nigeria, Nicholas State, North, North Fork State, North North uh, North Arizona, North uh, North Carol, uh, Carolina AT, I mean ANT, then uh, number uh, ninth ranked uh, North Carolina, Northern uh, Northern Illinois, North Texas, Northeastern, Northern Iowa, Northwestern, North uh, uh, Northwestern State. Number 23 ranked uh, Notre Dame, uh, Oakland, Ohio, uh, nor number 25th ranked Ohio State, number 11th ranked Oklahoma, Oklahoma State, Old Dominion, Old Miss, Old Roberts, and my team, the number 42 Oregon Ducks, Oregon State, Pacific, Pennsylvania State, Number 40th ranked Pennsylvania, Pepperdine. Number 17th ranked uh, Pittsburgh, Portland, Portland State, Perry View, Princeton, and in a uh, number 46th ranked uh, number 46th ranked uh, Providence, and number 29th ranked Purdue, and Quinney. Uh, Quinny Pecky, I think I think that, that's right. I messed it right up. Quinny uh, Quinny uh, Pecky, uh, Peck. <laughs> Sorry if I can't pronounce that right, guys. Sorry about that. Then uh, Rafford, Rhode Island, Rice, Richmond, Ryder, Robert Morris, Ruggers, South Southeastern Louisiana, Southeastern Missouri State. South, uh, Southwest Missouri State, Sacramento State, Sacred Heart, St. Francis, number 16th ranked St. Joseph's, St. Louis, St. Mary's, Sam Houston State, Samford, San Diego, San Diego State, San Francisco, San, San, San Jose State, Santa Clara, number, number 13th ranked to St. Hall, Sina, South Carolina State, South Alabama, South Carolina, South Florida, South Hill, number 41th ranked Southern Illinois, Southern, Southern Methodist, Southern Miss, Mississippi, Southern Utah, Southwest Texas, St. Bonavent, Bona Ventier. Sorry, sorry, sorry if I forgot to catch that right. Then at number four, fourth ranked St. St. John's and St. Paul's, New Jersey, St. Peter's, number 20th ranked Stanford, Stephen F. Austin, and then Stinson, Stony Brook, number seventh ranked Syracuse, Temple. Number 50th ranked Tennessee, Tennessee State, 
Tennessee Tech, Tennessee, Tennessee Ch Chattanooga, Tennessee Martin, number 14th ranked Texas, Texas A&M, Texas, Texas Christian, Texas Southern, number uh, 13th ranked Texas Tech, Texas Ar Arlington, Texas San Antonio, the uh, Kendall, Toledo, Townsend, Forest State, Tulane, number 49th ranked Tulsa, UC Irvine, UC uh, Riverview, UC S Santa Bill, UCLA, number uh, 43 ranked uh, UNLV, USC, UTEP, Utah, Utah State, BMI, Val Val Paraso, and Vanderbilt, Vermont, Villanova, Virginia, Virginia Commonwealth, Virginia Tech, Wagner, number number 18th ranked White Wake Forest, Washington, Washington State, then number 45th ranked uh, 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 Weber State, and uh, Western K Kentucky, West West Virginia, Western Carolina, Western Illinois, Western Michigan, West Wichita State, William William and Mary, Win Win Winthrop, and in uh, number 19th ranked Wisconsin, and Wisconsin Green Bay, Wisconsin Milwaukee, Wolford, Wright State, Wyoming, Xavier, Yale, and uh, in the Youngstown State. And that's all the teams, guys. Yeah, a lot. I know. <laughs> so, we're going to go ahead and, 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 and which I can't show off the arenas be, be, because there's no options to go to a certain arena. Uh, well, a uh, court. So, so hey, let's get started with the first three games. Starting with the Oregon Ducks. Okay, guys, this is the first game of our three. We'll actually have our six, technically, because I'll be playing two teams with three games. So, we'll be playing six games here, so we'll go ahead and start with the Ducks as they, this was their closest loss of the season as when they faced Alabama, and plus it was at ne uh, Las Vegas, Nevada, so but yeah, so it was an away game for both these teams, but let's just go with Oregon and Alabama, so let's just do it. Alright, go all conference level. Do baseline high in ten minutes, and let's do it. So hopefully these games won't be as long as the college football game, except that's for dang sure, so. Because sometimes for me, to play in those kind of takes, a, kind of takes like a half an hour to 45 minutes, which hopefully it, it, the, these games won't last that long, so. So yeah. Hi everybody, great to be here. I'm Brad Nestler with Mr. College Basketball, Dick Vitale. Here to call this exhibition matchup between the Alabama Crimson Tide and the Oregon Ducks. Number 10, the star whose team hopes he can take them to victory tonight. Well, he's putting up a chain, driving to the front, but I'm making a nice pass. You don't like seeing him with the ball if you're a defender. The Ducks will certainly want to take advantage of his presence on the floor. Possession and they're up and running. Now try to penetrate. Ball's tipped. It sticks. To number five. He drains the jumper. Sometimes you gotta have to thread the needle sometimes when you pass it. You gotta get back after your gamble! Yeah, that usually costs. 
cost your team an easy deuce. Passes it. Drains the shot. So yeah, you notice Brad, Brad, uh, Brad Nessler does both the college football and basketball games. So. The sophomore with the jump hook. Yep, there you go. It up. Takes the jumper. Number 33 with an easy two. Sorry guys, my uh, need to hit the stand there. I was trying to pass it to the guy on the 
Left side of me and then Webster. Dumps it in. Number 21 from the low post. He misses the jumper. The Crimson Tide are intimidated inside and get nothing. Too physical. He took All right, and I got the foul on the shot. Yeah, this one's a little different. Got to get that little beam in that square. Yeah, four point play. Got it. Yeah, sometimes I really concentrate on that beam. Got to watch it where it goes. Or we'll, we'll post that. I mean, how fast it's moving. Got it. <laughs> but still, I got a big lead though.
at the end of the first half. The Ducks are up by 15. All right. Okay, let me go down. Oregon enters the ball. Oh shoot! Thought I, my guy was right there, so got a little butt happy there. Happens. The senior with the J drops got it, it. <laughs> from long range. The Crimson Tide are making them pay the price out there. Passes it. The Crimson Tide block out on every possession. Passes the rock. Tipped. Alabama to throw the inbounds pass. It in. The center blocks it. Oh, they got it. Dang. I mean, after I actually blocked it, then he, they got it back. It's a 10 point spread, Dick. Yeah, but 10 points can't be spread too quick, Brad. He's right. For the bucket. That was yeah, nice. First point of the half. Hey, he's feeling it from everywhere, baby. Second looks because of their defensive rebounding. There's oh, a shoot. steal. He drives to the hoop. Contact on the shot attempt causes the misfire. That one's off. An absolute stranglehold by the defense so far tonight. Hey, the other team has responded by throwing up quick shots, which is exactly what the defense wants. The pass is stolen. Hey, he's meant passing to 33, up. but the aim registered. Yes, yeah, sometimes that happens with this game. Once you want to do it to, uh, to uh, throw, throw the guy you want, I mean, which he actually throws it to, to, to someone else, which, which I hate. To number 35. Gets it back out. Oh, shit. Man. To number 50. I th yeah, I thought he was going to block it. I was going to try to pass it off and it didn't work. Kicks it out. Goes up with it. Good for two. opportunity dropped the ball down low and scored. Comes up empty. The Ducks secure another defensive board. The shooting guard takes the feed, dumps it in to number 35. He makes the number jump. three. The defense is taking a beating. Back to the drawing board, baby. To the senior. Too much contact there. It knocked him off balance a little. Number 35 gets the rock. Number 11 for two. What do you think, Dick? They need a timeout here, Brad. It's not smart to just throw it out of bounds. Passes the rock. Takes away the pass. Passes it. Number two from the low post. He is just lighting it up, Dick. He's beating his man to the spot and hit the shots, Brad. Tries for the deuce and makes it. This is an old-fashioned stop. These shots are falling from everywhere. Passes the rock.
was uncontested. There's simply no urgency on defense, Brad. He got a piece of it. Passes it. The defense is being very aggressive, fighting through those screens. Oh. Can't put it down. Alabama to take the ball out of bounds. Passes the rock. Intercepted. He uses the pro hop. Makes the shot. D3, yeah, up at 20. Sometimes you gotta love Dick by Town. Down the two. With the hook. Off target. The Crimson Tide are not crashing the offensive glass at all. To number 10. Goes up with it. Buries the deuce. Sophomore takes the pass. Nice adjustment for the basket. Pushes it up. With a small forward. Passes the rock. The shot to the baseline. Off the mark with that shot. The Ducks are nowhere near the hoop when the shot goes up. To the junior. Bounces off. Dick, this is how you beat a team on the boards. Exactly, and they're beating them on the boards fundamentally. Box it out, hip hugs, you name it. Dumps it in. Nail three. Long distance, Jay. The Ducks are simply on fire. It won't matter. Pretty much got this game in hand. Passes the rock. To the shooting guard. Number 11 takes the jumper. He nails the shot. To number 
50. It's no good. Takes the three pointer. Let's let it run out. Defense, it's baby. over. What a dominating performance. Number 10 didn't put up big numbers, but still they walk away with a win. I'll tell you one thing. This goes to show you how poor a team chemistry can take you, Brad. He wasn't mm -hmm. able to shoot the success of the offense, so he relied on his teammates. Tonight, they were able to capitalize on some solid teamwork, and they were able to put some points on the board as a unit, and that led to the W. Hey, let's go to our PT peers of the day. They were absolutely super scintillating sensational. Hmm. All right, guys, let's get ready for the second game. Okay, here we go. Here's the second game. This is a game where Oregon beat UCLA by one during this year at the pit. So let's go ahead and relive it. Things all good. We'll keep it the same way it was.
has it. Number five with a soft jumper. Fires away. Off the mark. Pushes it. To number 11. From the baseline. And sinks it. is the rock. Off the mark with that shot. Let's it fly. Terry's at home. The Ducks are stroking everything. Dumps it in. Pull up jumper from way out. Knocks it down. Number 11. Passes it. It sticks. Passes the rock. Number 15 at the baseline. Nothing going to come easy tonight, baby. They are really playing for keeps. Just lighting it up from the field. They're hitting open shots and putting in easy baskets. That's what I do. Dumps it in. Goes up with a shot. Number 43 sinks a bucket of his own. Oh shoot. Can I pass it too, too soon? That's what happened. Yeah, well, let's get the ball back. Yeah, the uh, Ducks used to play here be before they build a. Uh, Matthew Knight Court. I mean, well, Matthew Knight Arena, sorry. Matthew Knight Arena. Number one. Four, three. Nope. I thought my center could probably get it, but nope. <laughs> That's okay. But they got the three, though. He's got the stroke. Passes the rock. So he had the three. He got it. Yep. Got, got a three back. Oh, good, we have a steal. Oh, shoot. Ah, got it. Passes the rock. 
the rebound to number 21. I thought I got a steal. Oh, but you got swatted from behind. Get that weak stuff out of here. They are heating up this building where they're shooting right now, Dick. It's just keep coming, baby. He makes a strong move to the rack. Great mid-air adjustment for the score. They're feeling it from everybody on the floor, Brad. They're getting it from every spot on the court. Number 50 makes the jumper. Number 11 for two. Oh, that was that shot. Off. The Bruins are blocking off extremely well. Attempts the shot. Number one buries the jumper. He knocks down another bucket. This kid's got skills, Brad. And drains it. Hey, look out the wall, baby. Oh, fuck. The senior takes the pass. Number 43 from the low post. The Bruins are making string music from the parking lot. Oh, dang it. Shoot. Where the points to? He's a high riser, sensational baby. With the small forward, number eleven, the low post. It's no good. The Ducks are getting no second. They tied it up just like that. Man, man, the birds are tough, tougher than Alabama. Passes the rock. To the bucket, buries it. That's it, bro. What a breakdown defensively. Nobody rotated over. Nobody saw a ball in man. Wide open layup. You could have made that layup. Right, I don't know about that one. No, you can <laughs> that. Launches. Nails the J. For two points. The shot's off target. The Ducks are not giving up any second shot chances. Oh, shoot. Passes it. Great shot. No, God, I was trying to pass that one guy there and he didn't register. Brother, I hate when that happens. I really do. He's always not missing anything right now. Number 33 on the left side. Goes yeah. in. Needed that. Number 10. It's usually the one that carries the offensive load, Dick, but that just hasn't happened tonight. I've got a feel of this thing from out of that second half. Really on fire. I think he's a great young player who can light it up. And I'm going to tell you something. Any day like, I think we'll take advantage of it in the second half. At halftime, the Bruins are up by one. 
Oh, okay. No one was on him either. He still is on it. The point guard gets the rejection. That was bad for me. Dang it. The Bruins are cleaning up on the defensive boards out there. He hits the lane hard to the hoop. Too easy. That was way too easy. Hey, you can't stop what you can't catch. To the center. There, I've got steel. Hey, are you kidding me? They're making me nervous. Ah, he came out of nowhere, too. I mean, he was open, and once, yeah, once he reached his hand there, he took it away. to pass into 33. <laughs> this is frustrating, guys. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, we just got a three back. Yeah, that block. My threes are just off. They just don't want to hit. He's been my top guy so far. Number 
for 33. Goes up with a shot. Dreams it. That's only I could get. I could come back if I keep hitting those 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 uh, threes from number 33. Oh, dang it. First one is yeah, I missed good. it. I got that one. Oh, I took up too long. Dang it. Yeah, you got really good deep. Yeah, guys, you gotta really concentrate on that. I mean, it doesn't matter how fast it goes or how t or, 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 or how slow it goes. And they just got a basket on that. It seems that uh, when when they shoot up, they never miss. I mean, especially I mean after I, I make a shot. He's been my guy. <laughs> and that and that when I tied it up. I uh, make a shot, they make it right back. And my guy. Hey Brad, get in the guard's back and get me and stop it up right. Oh, absolutely. The Ducks continue to take care of their glass. There we go, got that one going down. It's just something, when I played with, with them on, on Dynasty, it was the same team, the same game, that I was in a close game with. And this was the, the game right here. And it just, it never fails here. What was that UCLA? I mean, I whooped them. But just, here at the pit, and he got the foul. And, I thought he was setting the line. Nice there we go. We got the reflection. The deflection there. Ah, uh, they did. We'll take the shot. No good for the Bears. He's making just terrible choices shooting the ball. He's got to settle down, man. Settle that cat down. This is worth the second look. Receives the pass. Get my main guy. There we go. Made it. I was I was trying to pass in my center. And they made me pay for it. You're Oh, Passes it. Number 50. Handles the feed. Number 15. Wide open. At least you make the highlights. 
Oh, dang, I, pre I pressed the button too soon. Passes the rock. Number 11 puts up the J. There you go. The freshman from the baseline. Ah, nope. And that's open shot. You got it. Of course you did. There you go. Do that. I mean, man. Talk that one up to the crowd, Dick. That could be a real asset, Brad. And then he got. <laughs> Dang, he buried it. Passes the rock. Shoots it. Throws the two. This team right now just lighted it up from everywhere. Hey, they're finding each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. Contact causes the shot. Oh, shoot. Yeah, okay. oh, dang it. I was trying to, we're trying to get the ball and just... No, he missed that one. He made a second. Oregon to take the ball out of bounds. Got it. Quick score here in foul, right, Dick? Absolutely. They want to stop that clock as much as possible. And he got it, my goodness. <laughs> just happens to put up the three and it goes right down. Up with a shot. Got it. They need now is a quick score, right? And use as little time as possible. Missed it and I win, yes. Oh my goodness, another close win against the same team that had a problem with the Dynasty on here. Woo! There you go, guys. There's a good game right there for you. Hold on for that one. One by one that game, they win by two in this game. By the same same result. All right, all right. So let's get ready for the third and the final game with Oregon. All right, guys. The final game. This is the last game of the season for Oregon when they lost uh, when they got uh, when they lost to, to Michigan. I mean, in the I well in the in the NIT. Is the fourth game at uh, uh, on my MSG? So, so we're gonna, just gonna say that 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 uh, Oregon's at Michigan because that that's the way it was. So, so let's do it. Okay. Jeez, <laughs> that last game, unbelievable. It just something about UCLA at Oregon that makes it close. That's twice. Hopefully we won't have that same issue in this game, or, or or with the or with any of the Gonzaga games. Hi everybody, I'm Brad Nessler with Nick Vitale here to call this exhibition matchup between the Michigan Wolverines and the Oregon Ducks. Yeah, 
control. They'll begin their offense. Number 10 for two. He buries the shot. Nope. Rebound, coming the other way. Tipped. Oh, here it was. To the sophomore. Passes the rock. Oh, the jam. That shot will end up getting you out of the Oh, shoot. Let's go back and watch that basket again. <sighs> Of it. He did. Looks at a three. Ran up. Shot. No, no three. Okay. Number 10, ball for the foul. At the foul line. He hits his first. I thought he was in the key open in the last minute, but no, it didn't work. Number four, drains the jumper. The small forward on the right side. Number five with the jump hook. Buries the deuce. They should force these guys to shoot more jumpers, don't you think, Dan? Yeah, precisely, Brad, because if they're forcing them to shoot jumpers, that means that they're not getting beat by easy layups in transition. Senior. At the top of the circle. Oh, I have to see that one again. The Ducks are on a roll. That's, that's what I want to go to number 11, but nope. The game said nope. Okay, we're glad, we're glad they missed it. I wasn't playing, but it worked.
the jumper. I'm trapped there. <laughs> there you go, that's you. Too fast. Main game. Two in a row. <laughs> no way. Passes the rock. Number ten takes the jumper. Got it. Doesn't get any better unless you watch it again. Number thirty-one at the baseline. The senior goes for three. Nope. Yeah, I know. Oh, good. Welcome to steal. Uh, that'll work. <laughs> that'll work. This kid is the real deal. Super scintillating sensational. He makes a strong move to the right. The number four goes up with it. He got it. Good for two. It. To the center, goes up, number five with an easy two. He gets another shot off and in. Hey, this show is about to start, Brad. Goes up for two. Number two sinks a bucket of his own. To the sophomore. Oh, shoot. Oh, well, the ball back and I didn't shoot. Uh, well, I had the ball back and then they, they, then they took it away. Shot. Passes a rock. That's 
offensive foul. At the free throw line. First one is no good. Wide open too. Hey, that's no excuse. They got to dig down deep and get the job done. That's right. Oh, he missed the dunk. And <laughs> rebound. The Ducks are being very disciplined on the defensive glass. From beyond the arc. Another. And they're making this that time. Oregon displayed a spectacular shooting performance Nick, in that first half. Indeed, Brad. I predict the defense will come out and really be a lot sharper in the second half. They better be ready to play. At the half, the Ducks are ahead by 13. Shot. He sinks another basket. What are they going to do with this guy, Dick? I don't know, Brad, but they better do it quickly. Tries the two. The Ducks were looking to score that one in the post, and they did. Number five picks up the defensive foul. First personal foul. Number four to the line, shooting two. He hits his first. The Ducks are limiting these guys to only one look. Passes the rock. Number 33 from the baseline. He's been my, my he's, I mean, he's, he's, uh, he's been my three guy ever since the last game. Number five delivers the hard foul on the way up. The senior steps to the charity strike. He misses the first. Has the ball out of bounds. Passes it. Launches. That is a dagger in the heart, that shot, Nick. Hey, they lost focus here. They need a timeout to regroup, Brad. Dumps it in. Three pointer. It won't nope. fall. The Wolverines aren't getting any scoring on second chance buckets. The senior. That one goes. Oh, that's blocked, yeah. Game. Dipsy Doodle, Dr. Rowe, are you kidding me? Passes the rock to the center. Number 33 puts up the J. He's good for another score. And to his face, any time now, boys? Sweet touch. Number two takes the jumper. He missed. The Ducks are not giving up any second shot opportunities. Passes it. Number four with the foul. Second personal foul. Number 11 goes up. Dick, they really need to get something going in a hurry here. Yeah, call the timeout and get your boys into the game, Brad. Puts up the jumper. Makes the shot. The Wolverines are down by 16. Passes the rock. Number five, number two. He rattles it home. 
Much better than the last game, that's for dang sure. He spins to the bucket, passes it to the point guard. Passes the rock to number 21. That's a rip. No good. Number 33 pulls down the rebound. To number 10. Shoots. Sticks the deuce. With a small forward. to go off the mark with that shot. Dick, these guys are simply eating up all the rebounds. They read, and most of them are coming right from under the rim. To the sophomore. They really seem to be letting this one get away, Dick. Yeah, there's been a breakdown somewhere. They need to talk this one over, Brad. Passes the rock. It's good. The Wolverines are down by 20. The small forward handles the pass. Let's it fly. Knocks down the two. Seems to have it knocked right back to me. <laughs> That's okay, I'll take it. Kicks it out. Ball's tipped. Better clean it up. The Pistons are firing on all cylinders right now. This is a well-oiled machine right now. Takes the shot. No. Nope. Dick, this is how you beat a team on the boards. Exactly, and they're beating them on the boards fundamentally. Boxing it out. Hip hugs, you name it. Knocked out of there. Blocked. Number 11 for two. Nope. He misses it. He won't fly him on the way to the hoop. He kept the hole on the floor long enough to soak the screen to get the nice look from the inside. The number 11. Can't put it down. Brings it down. The shot. Hey, check out the mascot, baby. Is he into this or what? Judging by his reaction, I think he wishes he was playing. Well, do you think he liked that last dunk? What mascot? Michigan has no mascot. Because <laughs> I don't see a Wolverine there. There you go, I made a fast one. There you go. Nine times out of ten, I don't make those. Every time it goes that fast. The 
Okay, I think it's time to to, uh, to uh, bring in the, the the closers. that good. Is dead, so I'm just going to run it out. This well, this one wasn't so close as the last one, <laughs> so just like with Alabama, this is a good dominating win. Okay, guys, I'll be back with the first Gonzaga game. Okay, guys, this is Gonzaga's first loss of the season, and it was against this team of Stanford out of the Pac-10 Pac back in the day. So, so let's go ahead and let's play. Technically, this game was held in, uh, I'm in Oakland for some odd reason, but yeah. Maybe Stanford was having renovations to the, to the stadium. I mean, yeah, to the court. I don't know, but yeah. So, but yeah, anywho. So yeah, I mean, yeah. So yeah, I mean, this was uh, the closest loss that that season. So, so we're playing it. Hi everybody, I'm Brad Nestler, alongside Dick Vitale, calling this exciting NCAA exhibition matchup between the Stanford Cardinal and the Gonzaga Bulldogs. for the possession and they move it up the floor. The power forward with a rejection. 
sinks the shot. Passes it. Number 22. He looks to knock it in. He hits it. Passes the rock. Puts up the shot. Number one hits the deuce. Number 
three, but I got it. Usually my power forwards will make three, so we get that time. Number 22, for two. He drains the bucket. Top of the circle, they're working around the perimeter. Number four, from the baseline. There we go. Down. Short here. Hey, 
has it. Nails the jumper. Passes the rock. Looking at the round the perimeter. Nails the sweet jumper. Dick is the defense giving up. No, I just think they're being overwhelmed by this offensive display. the finger roll. right back to them. The shooting guard goes for the deep one. This is on the three-point attempt. The Bulldogs are doing a great job of securing the rebound before getting out in the open court. From the baseline. Time to go time out here? Yeah, their boys are beginning to fade. Now I'm starting to open it up.
personal foul. To the line. First one is good. The Bulldogs have 15 rebounds. Passes the rock. Number 30. There's the block. Shot off. The Bulldogs have 17 rebounds. Away the pass. Uh, I got this game in hand, so it's alright. Passes it. He makes a hard drive to the hoop. Number 20 gets caught with a hat at the free throw line. He gets it to go. Number one with the board. the other way, on the break. Number 33 has assessed the foul. There's a tough shot and one. He wanted that one, baby. He says you got to foul me harder than that. Passes the rock. Takes the jumper. Sinks it. It's a strong move to the rack. It won't fall. Passes it. Good for two. It just seems I really want I've been helping second half in these games. Number 22, Buffalo Post. Shot clock is dead. So I just gotta just, 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 just dribble it out. Such an evenly matched opponent. Hey, let's talk about our stars of stars. Yes, sirree. These guys were absolutely sensational today. Okay, guys, we're back with the second Godzilla game. All right, guys, this is for the, the second Godzilla game, and this one was a, their, their closest win against Santa Clara. And plus, this was in their conference uh, tournament. And what, it plus, it was in the first round, and Gonzaga won by two over Santa Clara. And plus, it was at Santa Clara for, for, the, for the conference championship. So, all right, so let's go ahead and do it. Yeah, it's something in the first round where, uh, yeah, yeah, they yeah, yeah, barely uh, hung on, <laughs> which they actually won the rest of the conference tournament, and then they went on to the to, to the tourney. But yeah, so.
passes the rock. Number 34 with the J makes it. This is swarming defense. Passes it to number one. It won't fall. The point guard takes the pass. Passes the rock. Watch it away. Yeah, Come here. on, baby. That was super synthetic sensational. Number Look at that one. Makes the lay in. That's awesome, baby. What a capital A. Dumps it in. Number one or two. He buries it. Hopefully the, the, this game will be a close one, like the Oregon one, for the second game. Number one, get it out of here. Passes the rock. They're working hard on defense to get through those screens. Sit down. That's seven on answer. To the shooting guard. These kids are leaving it all on the floor tonight. That's determination. Number 11 takes the jumper. Off the, he makes the block. With a small forward. Takes the jumper. Scorches the net. The Bulldogs are stroking everything. Passes the rock. Number four, and foul. Number 32 to the line. Shooting three. It's the first. That's an 11 nothing run. Pushes it up court. Jumper. Dick, they really need to get something going in a hurry here. Yeah, call a timeout and get your boys into the game, Brad. Yeah, I'm just opening it up. <laughs> Very early. Number 43 gets the two. Dick, he's in a serious rhythm. Hey, that's because he's getting the ball in rhythm, Brad. Very important. Passes coming. the rock. Watch it as that's an number 30 from the low post. Yeah, shot was kind of an unexpected shot. Because I didn't know I had the ball because I thought I lost it. The number 33. Goes up. Shot off. Oh. Number 40 cleans the glass. Passes it. Right here, right here, right here. The center with the block. Two. Passes the rock with the J. Number 33 with the three. The Bulldogs are just red hot from outside. Number 43 is all for the offense. 
defensive foul. Second team foul. Brad, this defense is here to stay, baby. Number one, range the two. 
They are eating up this building where they're shooting right now, Dick. It's just keep coming, baby. Right 20 already. Senior passes it to the power forward and makes it. This team right now just lighting it up from everywhere. Hey, they're fighting each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. No good. Wow, look at the rotate over. Well, twice. Shot clock is off. Play for the last shot. The point guard on the left side. Dreams it from that <laughs> Dick, they are on a deadly tear right now outside the yard. Everyone's into the action tonight, baby. Gonzaga shot a very good percentage in that first half. Patience a perfect execution. Did a very big part in that, Brad. Great job by the offense. Time, the Bulldogs lead by 23. He's making substitutions here. Gonzaga with the throw in. Takes his jumper and drains it. They just can't seem to miss. They found a serious stroke with their shooting run. Passes the rock. Straight to the rack. Nice adjustment for the basket. These guys are getting to the rack, getting to Jay. Unstoppable. To number 43. And sinks it. The Broncos are behind by 23. Small forward. Up fake for two points. Range the shot. I'm just playing phenomenal right now. Every time I put up a shot, it goes right in. Well, at 
Texas said this game is not like the Oregon and UCLA game, for sure. Great body control for the score. set up before they passed it in for the score. Great team patience. Launches the bomb. Number 40 drains the tray. The senior for two. It sticks. To number 45. Off target. He pulls down the board. The center takes the pass. That's picked off. Oh, hey, kid's got great defensive court sense. Number 40 gets the rock. Buries it. The Broncos are behind by 23. See how much I'm made, Bobby? <laughs> I don't think they're going to make it. Number 34. He misses it. Pulls down the rebound. The Bulldogs need to earn the rebound. For the deuce. Can't put it down. The Bulldogs are doing an excellent job on the defensive glass. Passes it. Picked out of the oh, air. Oh, shoot. I pressed the X twice. Dang it. Dumps it in. That was my bad. Slot it out of there. Block no, it doesn't matter. It's a block party out there. Passes the rock. Ball's tipped. Mm -hmm. Number 10, back to the circle. Gonzaga is having a great game shooting the ball so far, Dick. This is a very fundamentally sound ball club on offense, Brad. Block shot. Yeah. <laughs> no, not just that. Passes the rock. For two. And it goes in. Passes it. It's tipped. Sophomore takes the jumper. Great shot. He blocks the shot. Number 13 gets his first action tonight, Dick. You ask me, Brad, this kid could easily be a star. Oh, shoot. Number 32 coming in for the first time tonight. He will give this defense a different kind of threat at this position. Smart move. It's doing a great job of denying any shot opportunities off the screen. It won't fall. The Broncos are really boxing out hard these last few possessions. To number 45. Sets up his defender with a quick jab step. Here's one for the highlight reel. of it. Number 34 for two. And he can't hit the shot. They anticipate so well defensively. The point guard takes the feed. Number 30 for two. He hits it. You're seeing shots looking right right now. In the middle. And up. Strokes the two. the deuce. Intercepted. Number 30 goes up. He 
comes up empty. The center makes the block. Okay, we can step out of here. The defense refused to get put up in those screens, Brad. Takes his jumper. Number 20 hits the deuce. By 30. Well, so much for the close game. Like wasn't in a, in a real life. But, yeah. Number 11 with a one-handed jam. Look at that. That's unbelievable, baby. Tipped. Knocks it down. That's a top shot. And I knocked the guy down. He's doing it, too. And then they call, but uh, they're going to call charging. Passes the rock. Oh, now my ball. Gonzaga passes the ball into play. Passes it. Tries the two-pointer. Nichols a twine. How do you slow these guys up? They've got to start hitting some shots on their own. It's not. But we got not enough time for him to come back. Shot. Knocks down the two. Passes the rock. This defense isn't yielding an inch. Hey, new offense looks very timid, Brad. Passes it. Goes up for two. Makes the shot. And sinks the shot. <laughs> Number 45 for two. Okay. He nails the shot. Now I'll just run it out because the uh, shot clock is dead. So. No many fashion in this one. No question about it. Destroys their opponent. With the difference in these two teams' rankings, the win was pretty much a poor guy to push. Yep. Hey, let's go to our PT Fears. They were awesome, baby, with a capital A. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get ready for Gonzaga's final game in this game. Okay, guys, this game was Gonzaga's final game of the season as they lost to Nevada in the, I mean, in the second round of, I mean, well, what do they lost in, I mean, in, in the second round of the NCAA tournament. And plus, it was in Seattle, too, so it was kind of close to home for them, but yeah, Nevada had to be a good team during the tournament, and I can't remember how, I can't remember how far they went, but yeah, so... But yeah, but, but yeah, but Gonzaga fell, fell to this team in that year, so let's go ahead and have the, the rematch. And plus it'll be at Gonzaga because it was in Seattle, so so it's closer to well, from, Se from Seattle, so yeah. <laughs> and plus they haven't we'll, we'll played as Gonzaga, Gonzaga home team yet, too, so. The 
senior takes the pass. Passes it. Number 10 commits the foul. With the pair. He makes the first shot. Number one grabs the offensive rebound. Gets the fade to fall. Gonzaga's the best basketball team in Washington. <laughs> the, uh, yeah. Passes it. Number four with the ball. He tries to knock down the three. No, but he hits it. Because they don't have an NBA team in uh, Washington anymore, so, so I mean, Gonzaga has kind of took in that title. So... Plus, Washington and Washington State are really down. So, say they're not always at the top of the college basketball ranks every year, and Gonzaga usually is. And 
Yeah, that just dubs it. I mean, dubs it that they're the best 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 team in Washington. Goes up for two. Goes in. They're lighting it up from the field right now, Dick. They're in a dangerous rhythm, my friend. Dangerous. Dangerous for the defense if they keep it up. One bust the thing out of Eastern Washington, but they're not hardly that good, so. He takes so, yeah, the so, I mean, Gonzaga has uh, in that title. I mean, that's the best basketball team in the state of Washington. Number three, the ball close. To the senior. Passes the rock. Oh, okay. need to the I, was, I mean, I was trying to thread the needle. That didn't work. Passes it. Great defensive play, rotating over. Played that screen really well up on top. Knocked out of there. Blocked. He got blocked, even though he did a good job of setting him off that screen. I guess it just wasn't good enough. Oh. We did see that again, Brad. Of it. 
in anticipation defensively. To number one. The defense is denying any opportunity to get a shot off on those screens, Brad. Got it. Shot clock is dead. Passes it. For two. Oh, yes. He is just lighting it up, Dick. He's beating his man to the spot and hit the shots, Brad. Number one, ball for the foul. Two shots. Gets it. on the boards in the first half. And you know what really impressed me, Brad? They did it with textbook box out four. They sealed off. We see so many kids that don't box out. Not this team. At the half, the Bulldogs are ahead by 13. Yes. Do a little bit of... Do a little bit of something here. Because I'm recording this on the I mean, I'm recording this on the fourth of July, so yeah. <laughs> I hear a lot of pops out there. We'll take the shot. Knocks down the two. He might be on his way to a career game, partner. Well he will, Brad, if they don't get somebody on him in a hurry. Too much contact there. It knocked him off balance a little. He blows by him on the way to the hoop. Rejected. Passes it. Ball's tipped. Gonzaga gets things started with the entry pass. Gonzaga is cutting loose on the offense tonight. Hey, every mistake the defense makes, they're capitalizing on it, Brad. Picked off. Passes the rock. This one get away, Dick. Yeah, there's been a breakdown somewhere. They need to talk this one over, Brad. He makes a strong move to the rack. Number four delivers the hard foul on the way up. Number 23 is going to the line. He hits the first shot. Focus here. They need a timeout to regroup, Brad. Misses on the jumper from three. Dick, you couldn't ask for a better defensive performance, could you? No, Brad. I'll tell you one thing. Lockdown began about two more for this defense. Gets it to fall. Passes the rock. Answers with a basket of his own. Passes it. Number 33. He shoots from the top of the circle. He hits the shot. Number 23 takes the feed. Wow, the defense is doing a great job of fighting for screens. But the night easy looks at the baskets, Brad. Nine 
10 seconds to put it up. Stop it, Bob. Nails the jumper. He hits a bullseye again. And he's feeling it from everywhere, baby. Passes the rock. Number 34 for two. He rattles it home. The pass is stolen. Hey, he got a clean break on it. Passes it. Number 10 from downtown. Look at this last play right here. I'm going to say it for everywhere right now. Man, one of Dominic Fast for these last, well, this Stanford was the closest one, but still, yeah. But finish, yeah, Dominic Fashion for all these two games. Now trying to penetrate. Good for two. Passes the rock. Number 10, Byers. Why not? He gets the bucket. Number 
42. Great body control for the score. Passes it. No good. He brings it down. Passes the rock. Picked out of the air. Another turnover created by Great D, Brad. It won't fall. Nails the deuce. Passes it. He swats it away. Passes the rock. To number three. Quick jab step. Ten seconds to get it off. Passes it to number 23. Number 42 goes up. He comes up empty. The small forward takes the three. Great shot. The defense is being very aggressive, fighting through those screens. Shoots off target. And he pulls this, down the board. That's wrong button there. My uh, my thumb hit hit circle there on accident. Passes the rock. The puck is off. No, I'm just going to... Passes it. I'm the sophomore on the right side. I'm just going to dribble it out. Jeez. Well, talk about redemption. I got it. This game in convincing fashion. The outcome was never in doubt, but it's always a question of how dominant they would be. That's right, baby. Hey, let's go to our PT beers of the day. They were absolutely super scintillating, sensational. So, my center again got the top right of the game. So. Alright, guys, so. So what's next on this game? I'm gonna be showing three special videos, the intros, and and uh, and ask the coach, and also a and also one more special game that the uh, I did a uh, all teams tournament in this game, and it's and it all came down to two teams that are playing for the title of I mean of of NCAA March 9, 2004. So yeah, so those are three videos are coming next after this. So. So guys, thank you for watching, and hopefully not too soon I'll be back with with NCAA March Madness 2005, which is going to probably take me a while to do that one, so, because that one's got trophy cases, in, and like I said, I mean, it's going to take me a while to do, so, so yeah, that's all coming next, guys, so thanks for watching, and thank you for tuning in, which, which I know was a long time coming, but hey, but hey, the uh, way was worth it. Thanks for watching, guys.